do you know about PHPOC and do you know how easy it is to get started with it? Let me show you how to get started with PHPOC by using it to make a very simple IoT device in a few minutes. Firstly, you need to collect enough following hardware components. One PHPOC blue or black, and in case you use PHPOC blue, you need a USB wireless LAN adapter. One PC or laptop. One USB cable to connect PHPOC to PC. Secondly, we need to download and install PHPOC Debugger. This is a development tool used to write and upload the PHPOC script to PHPOC device and it can also be used for debugging. Okay, let's open a web browser and go to PHPOC homepage. Let's click download and tools to download PHPOC debugger. After downloading, Install this software by some simple clicks. Next step is that we need to connect PHPOC Blue to PC via USB cable. Okay, let's open PHPOC Debugger and choose COM port and click connect button to connect PHPOC Debugger to PHPOC board. Okay, next is that we need to configure Wi-Fi network so let's click setting button on PHPOC debugger and you can set static IP address or dynamic IP address here. Navigate to wireless LAN tab and choose infrastructure mode and input your Wi-Fi name and password. You can also use the search AP function. Note that if Wi-Fi network is not available, you can choose the soft AP mode to create a local Wi-Fi network. Okay, let's click right button to save the settings. Now it is time to write Hello World program. Okay, let's go to File menu and create index.php file. And let's write code. Let's type echo hello world and click Save button to save the source code. Now we can access them through a web browser. And before that, we need to know IP address of PHPOC board. So let's go to Function menu on PHPOC Debugger and choose Network Information. And we can see and copy IP address of PHPOC board here. Let's open a web browser again on your PC or smartphone and make sure that your PC or smartphone is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as PHPOC board. And let's type the IP address of PHPOC. And we can see Hello World here. Now, let's try an example of controlling LED via web page. Let's go to phpoc.com and download PSP support package. This package contains a useful library and examples. So after downloading, we need to upload the necessary library first. And then upload example images. Let's click Save button to upload the source code to PHPOC device. And you can upload some type of file such as image, JavaScript, CSS, or HTML file. Now we can access web page of PHPOC via web browser to control an LED. This LED is built into PHPOC board. By this way, you can control any devices via web page. These were just simple examples, and there are a lot of examples you can do with great features on PHPOC. So why don't you try it? Thank you!